Hello and welcome to this honest review of Amplify. I paid for this myself, so my review is going to be my own thoughts. Amplify is web-based software that allows you to make videos basically about products just using a URL and a couple of other things. Now, Amplify costs $18, and I think because I stayed on the site for some time, I got a discount code pop-up that gave me $4 off, so I paid $14 for it, and it has a 90-day money-back guarantee. So let's look at the software. So we're in the Amplify dashboard, and there is a 10-minute training video, and you've got two options. You can make an AI video review or just an AI video. There's a slight difference, so we'll have a look at these in a minute, but let's look at the AI video review. So we need to click on create video. So we need to fill these boxes in and pick a few things and the AI should do everything for us. Now I've had a few problems with this, so bear with me. I'm quite interested in this collapsible black backdrop portable background, so I'm gonna do a review of it. So I've grabbed the URL and I'm gonna take a few more details from here. So I've set my product name, just using copy and paste. The project name, I've given it the same, the same name. I've copied in a product description from the Amazon page. I've put in the URL. And this isn't obvious, but if you click here, you can import the product image from a URL. So I'm gonna do that. So that's the product image. Now I need to select the voice. I'm in the UK, so I'm gonna select English UK. I would like a landscape video but we can also select portrait or square. And I would like the background to be video and the category is probably technology. So there's lots of categories there. Now I click generate slide and this has happened many, many times and this infuriates me. It says the image not found at the provided URL, everything wipes. So you have to do it all again. So I'm gonna now do it all again. So this time I've done it all again and this time I took a screenshot and I have uploaded that file. So I've got to go through this all again, which is incredibly annoying. And let's hope this works. So this hasn't worked. It said an error has occurred. Please try again. But I'm not going to try again because all morning I've not been able to get this to work and it's thoroughly annoying. So if I go back to here to my videos, I can show you one I managed to make the other day, which is one about a kettlebell. So I managed to make this video review just by following the same steps as before, but it actually worked this time. And we've got an Amazon kettlebell, and I'm gonna show that. Amazon Basics Cast Iron Kettlebell Build Strength and Tone Your Muscles. Looking to switch up your fitness routine? The Amazon Basics Cast Iron Kettlebell is here to help. With its round ball-like profile and integrated loop handle, this kettlebell provides weight resistance and balance for a variety of upper and lower body exercises. It's time to take your workout to the next level. I also made this video, which is a sort of portrait video about a kettlebell, and that was ever so slightly different. I'm gonna call it test one, and I'm gonna click create project. We put in a script and it's slide based. So here we've got portrait landscape or square. Let's go for landscape. We can pick whether it's videos in the background. Yep, I'm gonna change that. Or pictures or colors. And we can write a script. Okay, so I put this a script with AI. Voiceover, we can pick someone. Let's have male Eric, save changes. We can go through font style. Now, at the moment, we can show the product image or not. If we click show the product image, we have to upload a file or we can import from a URL. At the moment, I'm just gonna hide it. Now, background, we can search for videos. Um, so let's search for a script. Let's add this one. Now, animation, we can have zoom in or zoom out. We can have title animation and we can have some music. We can upload a file or pick. I'm just gonna go with the default. So that's gonna create one slide. Now we might want to add another slide. So on slide two and the title is gonna be voiceover. I've just said this is a female voiceover from TTS. So let's do, let's select Amber. Let's click save. Let's have a background female voiceover let's search for this I don't know where the stock comes from 
and we need to save changes. If we don't save changes, things don't work. And I'm just going to click publish now. I'm going to go back to this slide. And I, yeah, that, that wasn't the one I picked for the background. I didn't click save changes, did I? I'm pretty sure I picked this one. And now I need to click save changes and that's saved it. And that's there. So I'm going to click publish. Yes, I want to generate it. Hello, this is a script with AI. This is a female voice over from TTS. A kettlebell is a weight training tool that consists of a cast iron or steel ball with a handle on top. It is used for various exercises, such as swings, squats, presses, and rows, to improve strength, power, and endurance. So those videos are actually quite good. I, I think there's nothing wrong with them. I don't think this saves you any time, though, if you... if there's an error in the video review or it doesn't work and it doesn't tell you where it's gone wrong so you just have to keep going over and again and putting it down to chance so if you need something that makes videos really quickly and you don't care too much about it this is great if you're doing product reviews it's only useful if it works and if it saves you time and to me this doesn't save time if it doesn't work a kettlebell is a weight training tool that consists of a cast iron or steel ball with a handle on top. It is used for various exercises, such as swings, squats, presses, and rows, to improve strength, power, and endurance. Kettlebells provide a versatile and effective workout, targeting multiple muscle groups at once and also improving cardiovascular fitness. They are commonly used in functional training, high-intensity interval training, HIIT, and cross-training programs. Using a kettlebell can be a great addition to your workout routine. Here are a few exercises you can try using a kettlebell. 1. Kettlebell Swing Stand with your feet shoulder-width apart and hold the kettlebell with both hands in front of you. Squat down slightly, then swing the kettlebell between your legs and use your hips to thrust it forward, keeping your arms straight. 2. Goblet Squat Hold the kettlebell with both hands against your chest, standing with your feet slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Squat down, keeping your chest up and 